What's up guys, Marty Targo here with another Shisha review, and um, today we're going to be reviewing Al Fokker's, oh I dropped the box, Al Fokker's Watermelon. I'm extremely excited to smoke this, I'm a huge watermelon fan, I've had a lot of different watermelons, I haven't tried Al Fokker's yet, and I'm hoping that it's really good. It smells, well first it's in this little package, if you haven't ordered Al Fokker's before, let me open this little bitch up. That is a very strong watermelon smell. Very, very sweet, very good smell. It is dyed red. It's pretty juicy. Not as juicy as Fantasia, obviously, but it's definitely very wet, very red, very juicy. Like I said, it smells very good. Very right on with watermelon. Maybe a little more candy watermelon, but it definitely smells very very good. So let me get this packed up, set up, and we'll review this. The bowl, the yeah, the bowl, the base, um, one cover, two coconut coals. I'm using the dual hose. So if you're wondering why I'm not getting the best smoke clouds out of this, though they're still pretty decent, it's because I'm just using this little washable hose, or not washable, disposable hose. But um, let's get right into this. You know what? Screw this hose. I'm switching to the the Canara washable hose. Give me like two seconds. Good smoke clouds. It had a lot better smoke clouds earlier. I've been this has been going for a while and has the wind cover on now. Um, it tastes just like it smells, really. It's very candy like, very um, watermelon, bubblicious, bubblegum flavor. If you're looking for a watermelon that's more like the fruit, this is not it. But it's still a really good taste. It's very candy flavor, very sweet. It's a very sweet tobacco. So if you're into that, this is tobacco to go for. Because um, you can't really compare this to the actual fruit because there's nothing to compare it to. But bubblicious watermelon bubblegum, if you ever had that, that's really what this gives off. And it really just gives off that smell throughout the whole room and you're smoking it. And it does go for a pretty decent long time. And as I said, I'm not giving the clouds justice at all right now. I've been smoking this for a while. Plus, I just got over being sick not too long ago, so it's, I don't know, not inhaling that much, so... <laughs> but it's a good taste it's a little more sweet to my liking I'm not a big sweet sweet tobacco guy though I, I do like it this is way better than the um, Nakala Maizo watermelon that I just completely hated no offense to anyone that likes that but this is a very sweet candy artificial watermelon <coughs> well, excuse me. <coughs> but like I said, don't let me smoking this turn you off from the Alfaka watermelon because it really is a pretty good tobacco. Let me try that for a second. Purge this for a second. Yeah, it actually does have really good clouds, despite what you're seeing here. So, um, with all the things I've said, I've 
not my best review, obviously. Um, I'm giving this a 7 out of 10, and Alfaka's a really good brand, so you can't go wrong there. Thanks, guys.